My name is Maya Marinelli. The project I'm working on is called Wind Playground. I spent half of my life being a professional sailor and half of my life being an artist. Wind for me is just pure poetry. For the longest time, the two things were actually fighting against each other, but I've been working with the idea of taking invisible law of physics like wind or pressure or weather which uh, for me are very tangible and physical and transforming to tactile and um, immersive installation and spaces. Wind Playground is a kinetic sculpture that is built with sail making technique and cell cloth. The way it's built, it has this uh, very organic multidimensional sails and there is different tubes in the middle of those sails. Basically, the sail catch the wind and then it pipes it into the tubes, create like a wind tunnel and, and the wind kind of howls and, and accelerate inside the structure. The user then can actually walk into the tunnels, being blown away by the wind or play with the wind or climb some of those structures and just sort of enjoying this, the physicality of wind. Playing a wind playground is kind of like standing in front of a big fan. As we were building it, we called the alien all the monsters and we just sort of made fun of it. The material that I use are the same materials and the same colors you will find on a kite sail or on a windsurf sail. So it's very bright and some of them are reflecting, some of them are semi-transparent and I sort of play with the same idea. A sail is basically a, a sculpture, a three-dimensional object that is built with different panel of very strong, flat, robust material, just like this piece of uh, film. And it's cut with curves and shapes, so that when it's stitched together, it becomes a three-dimensional shape, like this model right here. So all these little pieces of flat materials, cut in a certain way, can create very complex three-dimensional shape. Based on the anatomy of a sail, I then decide to make something plateful that yet could allow people to understand both wind dynamics and the science behind uh, sailmaking. Thank from uh, a generous grant from the Black Rock Art Foundation. Thank you, Black Rock Art. We are now um, done with pre-production and we know how the sculpture is gonna look like, uh, what material we're gonna need, what our technical issue, and we're ready to start production and build this thing. If you got a million dollars, what would you do? Dig into creating a sculpture that is capable of creating a system of high pressure and low pressure within the sculpture and create a constant flow of air and wind and controlling this constant flow of air and wind and transforming the sculpture into a wind powering machine. Imagine an energy system that is based on wind, that is portable and then can create energy even when there is no wind.